That's the vibes. That's the vibes right like there. The right there. Right there. What's poppin' YouTube? It's your girl Jay, and I'm back again to pop my sh. Right now, I'm outside of work. I'm gonna have to go back in, but I just want to come open up the vlog here before it gets too chaotic. If you are new to my channel, make sure you subscribe to this channel, like, comment, and share. So many people looking at me, I feel so awkward. But I had to come open up this vlog, and I couldn't do it inside, of course, because it's music playing, and I don't want to get copyrighted. And I wasn't rushing to do it at the house. I just didn't know if I was going to vlog today. The habit of just vlogging and then deciding if I want to use the footage for it or not. So, um, this is what I got on today, you know, all black. And yeah, today's Tuesday. Y'all know how Tuesdays go. Um, I did get a little footage while I was inside. But yeah, so I'm going to go in and chill until the crowd comes. And I will see you guys later. I really be hating on the music be playing because I really be trying to get food. My picked up my journal. Um, I the last time I journaled was. So today is May 26, Wednesday. The last time I journaled was April 23rd. I will be bringing more of mental and spiritual guidance within my channel because that has been a major, major part of my journey. I'm just like out of funk today. That's the reason why I picked up my journal and I wrote in it today. And so, um, for the first time ever, I'm going to let you guys know what I wrote in my journal. You know, just to let you guys know. Like, if you want to start journaling, I think you should. I think everyone should write down their thoughts and ideas and feelings. That's what I do. Because me, I'm the type of person, like, I don't really talk to other people um, about my feelings. And I really don't even know how to tell people about my feelings. You know, past trauma, past things. So today, for the first time ever, um... In my journal, I wrote things that I want to fix and how to fix them. And I'll just share two of them. I'm going to share all. One is, I learned that I'm often defensive when I am misunderstood. I would like to change that by listening to the other person or the other party before reacting in a certain way. Because me, I'm a type of person, it's like I'm always in defense mode. A lot of people around me say that I probably have an attitude or whatever. And it's not that I have an attitude intentionally. It's just, like I said, past trauma, past things that have triggered me to always keep my guard up and to always be in defensive mode. And now me being 21, me self-reflecting on myself, I know that that's not always the case. I shouldn't have a guard up. I should always understand the person and help them understand me if I am Feeling like I am being misunderstood, if that makes sense. This last one that I wrote is, I understand that everything I go through is all a part of God's plan. And in his timing, things will unfold for the better for me. Because I think that anytime something happens, like anytime something around me changes or something major happens and it affects me in a negative way, I feel as if like, oh, like my life is over and that's not always the case you know god has a mysterious way of doing things it's all a part of his plan us as human beings we have to understand that majority of things that we go through is bigger than us you know it's bigger than what we can see it's bigger than what we can imagine so i have to just always remember that because even though i am going through certain things in my life and certain things are not going out the way that i want them to be God knows that I'm exactly where I need to be in at this moment and he will never leave or forsake me for anything. And I feel better even just with releasing that to you guys, which like I said, I want to start, you know, bringing more of my mental and spiritual health into my channel because that has become a big part of me. What's up y'all? So today is Friday. And I am, of course, getting ready for work. Let me try to find out. Oh, 
or whatever. But yeah, y'all, I'm getting ready for work. Um, it's Friday. I hadn't been vlogging all week. I really just want to give myself a little peaceful break. I had an off day, but today is Friday. I did work yesterday at the sports bar, and then tomorrow I work Saturday, Sunday. Which is Saturday, tomorrow, which is Saturday and Sunday, I work at the sports bar. So, um, yeah, we still, we still, you know, going to work everyday shit, everyday shit. You feel me? Yeah. Currently getting ready. Um, as y'all know, me and my coworker, we're gonna go get some food before work. We'll get us some drinks. Really kind of running they low key. We don't gotta be there to six. Like they start doing like times to where like some people come at five, some people come at six type shit. Cause it really don't be shit going like for everybody to be there at five. Like it don't be nothing going. Yeah, I'm kind of upset because my secret product that I use on my weave to help my weave. See, y'all see how the, the, the weave weaving, okay? It's weaving, but it's like, like, like it be weaving, but I need it to be weaving all night. So, my secret product that I'm not going to tell y'all about. <laughs> Um, I ran out, and so it that probably normally helped my weave, but I ain't gonna tell y'all about it because I don't know for sure. But I noticed that I didn't have it. Like I never put the product on this week because I ran out. So I'm gonna go get me some more of that product ASAP. But anyway, I'm gonna stop putting heat in it and shit. We just gonna lay this down. You know how I go. I look so pretty, like. I don't know I had it in the side part earlier this week, but I'm just a middle part ass bitch. I ain't even gonna lie. Like, when you see me, you see middle part. Like, okay, I'm not gonna lie. I like side part, but I like side part curly. Like, that's so pretty on my face. Like, side part curly, that shit is fire on me. But I don't be having time to curl my hair every day the hair is gonna give what it's gonna give okay it's gonna be given but i know i could give a little bit more with my hairstyles but see y'all when i make it to work so yeah Some girls do a lot of money. Um, and left me a really, really great tip. Um, I had another table they was throwing money, and me and my coworker, like they, they, they bought two tables, so she had one, I had one, so they was throwing money, so we split that. Um, what else? Then I had another table, but it was. Some of the girls that actually work there, they just came to get a booth and have fun. So, yeah. it's pretty much how um, my night went. I want to start, like, really just venting to y'all because, child, I don't have no other vent to. My mood lately, I feel like, hasn't been, like, the actual, like, best. I feel like I could do better, but for the most part, I'm doing good. And like I said in every video, thank you guys for watching me. I don't know. I don't even know what I'm talking about right now. I'm just, it's like I'm just talking. It's crazy how life just be happening. Like, it's crazy. That's why, honestly, y'all, I just live life with no regrets, especially now because it's like, like back then, I would like, you know, 
be like worried about my future like i always have anxiety about my future and like you know stuff like that but nowadays it's like i live life with no regrets you know i let things come and go and i feel like it's a good thing um that i'm learning like you know as i get older because it's like you know it's just like things come and go people come and go and it's just how it is Look like I did really, really good tonight, y'all. But yeah, I just wanted to come out here and just talk to y'all. I don't know what I'm talking about. <laughs> y'all know what I do want to do, though? Honestly, I really want to start. Like, I want to start, like, my own show. Like, my own little show. Because, y'all, I feel like I've been having crazy experiences, like, with guys and stuff. But I really really like want to have like literally like my own love show and have like a bunch of dudes like i know how be someone had her love show i'm one of those like have a bunch of dudes stay in the house and fight for their love for me but i think hers is more on the fake side i don't want to be on the real side like i'm not gonna put no midget on there and i know i don't mess with midgets like no like put me some scammers some hood niggas the trappers the dealers couple business men like some some good to choose from they gotta look good dress good like smell good oh my god like my show will be lit like i think i'm gonna do that for real y'all y'all heard it here first i'm gonna I'm make me a little show and um if you're watching this you want to be on the show let me know or if you got something that you want to be on the show let me know but yeah don't be trying to see me out there don't be trying to put me with people y'all know y'all know <laughs> Anyways, y'all, I'm finna count this money and I'm gonna go to sleep and I'm gonna see y'all tomorrow or maybe later on. I done made me a little drink for tonight. Okay, it's Lemonade Patron. Um, well, it's a Patron Margarita for real, for real. This is just without the. No, this is a Patron Margarita. That's exactly what this is. Wow. Period. Cheers. I'm finna continue to talk to y'all. But yeah. Like, y'all, I just be going through so much in my life, and I really be feeling like I don't have nobody on my side. And I always complain, like, and say, like, oh, I don't have friends. But in reality, I have over 4,000 friends that are subscribed to my YouTube channel, that like me, that support me. And it's like I'm over the whole, you know, doubting myself. I'm over trying to hold on to, you know, situations that are meant for me. And I'm saying this all to say that we go through things not to, like, not that, you know, for instance, like, I don't know, like, certain, like, certain situations that I went through, I feel like, you know, God was punishing me. And God never punishes. He only thing, he teaches you. He teaches you. You go through things and he teaches you. And it, the situations that you go through, it teaches you to be a stronger person. Like, you know, that's why I said, like, you know, I just want to change, like, my whole platform and really be transparent with you guys about real life. Because social media is not real life. That shit that y'all see on the shade room, that shit that y'all see these celebrities doing, that shit is not real life. Real life is taking L's and bouncing back. Like, ain't shit happened. That's real life. Real life is losing people in your life, but you know you still got him above and you know you still got yourself and you never losing yourself. That's real life. Like, I'm just being honest. Real life has its ups and downs. Every Some days I'm up, some days I'm down. Some days I'm happy, some days I'm sad. Some days I'm laughing, some days I'm crying. That is real life, period. I'm over there trying to prove to people that I'm okay when in reality I'm not okay. I'm over that shit. I'm over it. So, I don't know. I just feel like venting. I feel like somebody needs to hear that. But, like, real shit, like... This channel is really like, yeah, y'all gonna see me lit, see me, you know, lit, <laughs> working at the club and, you know, getting cute, getting pretty, but that's part of my life. But the other part of my life is what I really deal with. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, I deal with real life situations. I just have a lot of stuff that I dealt with in the past, a lot of situations that I've been through in the past that I haven't fully healed from. I'm not the type of person to fully heal over something. It does take me a minute. Some people heal slow, some people heal fast. <laughs> I haven't 
been vlogging all week because I've been doing a lot. A lot. Like, I've been on the go, on the run. So, as you can see, I'm at work. Um, I really did my hair, but I really hate. I don't like my head. I know that I hadn't been vlogging all week. And I miss you guys. I really do. But everything will make sense. It's gonna make sense why everything just been everywhere lately. It's gonna all make sense. Probably like the next few weeks, next couple months or whatever. It's gonna all make sense. But right now, just bear with me, okay? Like y'all might see me two weeks in a row. Then I'm gonna go go for like two weeks. Then I'm gonna come back to you know, just for right now. But I promise y'all, I'm gonna get it together. And it's gonna be lit. Subscribe to the channel if you aren't subscribed. I have said that already. Um, yeah, this is another. I don't know. I might have this a week in my life. I might not even post this vlog. As a matter of fact, everything you need to do. But uh, I might add in a little footage because I have been vlogging, but it's been choppy because I've been vlogging for like the past like, a week or two ago, and I don't think I dropped something since. I don't know. But anywho, I'm about to go back outside, and we're waiting for the crowd to come in. It's the new safe room. Everybody took a shot. Hey bitches, what it do? <laughs> it's popping. Um, I don't know if this is the start of a new vlog or if this is a new video. I don't know, but if it is, welcome to my channel. If you are new, hit that subscribe button, like, comment, share, you know, join the family, join the squad, okay? And if you are a returning subscriber, what's up? Hey, how you doing? I know you miss me. I know. No. Uh, like, it was kind of hot in there and it's just making it hard for everybody to worry. But anyway, y'all. I'm coming with you guys on money count today. This will be my last money count for a while because I have some things that's coming up. So um, I'm not gonna be really sitting down just doing money counts and things like that. So I decided to give you guys one because I think my, my last one is doing really, really good. So here I am with another one. I vlog today because it was lit. I did sell some bottles, but it was high. I really didn't feel like filming. And actually, I wasn't going to vlog. While I'm talking to you, I could be straight out money, right? A crazy day at work. Like, it was high. People was just being people. <laughs> Us, anyway. Yeah, look at my hair. My hair is all freeze. It was just so hot in there. <sighs> but, on the bright side, y'all, um... I really do appreciate y'all for y'all for really supporting me. Um, because obviously if you're watching this video, if you see this, you're supporting me. So thank you. Even if you are a hating ass bitch, hey. <laughs> but um thank you, thank you guys for the net thank you guys for the net. Thank you guys for the positive comments because y'all I've really, really been receiving a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of positivity. Um and yeah, I'm so excited on where this channel is going. Only God knows where this channel is gonna go for real, for real. Um, I got an idea on where I want this channel to go and things that um I have planned to do and everything. But um honestly, I'm just picking up the camera and I'm just going on by my day and just letting God use me for this channel because it, I had doubts like about what i wanted like my channel to originally be about like i had an idea on what i wanted to do but it was kind of like i really didn't know like i know i want to do youtube i know i want to be successful on youtube but i didn't really have an actual like niche you know what i'm saying um for the longest like i was just doing 
you know, whatever to get some views, you know, if you want to be completely honest. I really was. So now I feel like I kind of got a better idea and a better vision on what I'm supposed to do because child, at first it was almost like I was just trying to like force my videos and really i want my content to be perfect in a1 for you guys um even when it comes to like stuff like these like how i'm on vlog and like i don't want to vlog and my energy is down i don't want to vlog and i'm not looking good i'm not saying i have to be all dolled up like how i am now or even close to it but just you know i just want to you know take more pride and just put more quality towards my content if that makes sense because that plays a big big part in everything also you know with me you know venturing off into doing these bottle girl vlogs i've been saying like i can pull up a video i'm gonna pull up a video and insert it here i've been saying i want to turn this channel to a vlog channel i said that back in the beginning of 2019 roll clip i think i'm just gonna be a vlogger i'm gonna give me a vlog camera y'all because i think I'm just going to be a vlogger. So, yeah, that was the beginning of 2019. I was saying I wanted to, you know, turn this channel to a vlogging channel because I feel like it's easier. As y'all can see, I'm just sitting here talking to y'all as I do my money count. And um, I wish you guys can, like, see. I ain't going to lie. Y'all be in my DMs. Y'all be on my live. Like, when is, this, when is the next video? When's the next YouTube video? And it's not that I'm not filming because I'm not even going to lie. I literally just had to delete some videos from a couple weeks ago when I was vlogging. Um, because it's old footage. It's been two weeks since I recorded that. And I still haven't had time to just really sit down and edit. And I'm just not going to use it. So I do be vlogging. I just had time to actually just sit down and just actually say, okay, hey, I'm going to edit but uh i've been i've been getting into it you know i've been trying to do my best and like i said this will probably be like the last video y'all get from me well i know it's gonna be a last money count for a while but well i don't know when the next money count gonna be i ain't gonna say for a while like it's gonna be a long time but y'all gonna still get like you know vlogs and stuff but it's gonna be a little minute it's all gonna make sense soon it's all gonna make sense soon but yeah, I think I got everything straightened out. I just really been chilling, y'all, and just understanding that, you know, people come and go, things come and go, y'all. I just really been dealing with like a lot mentally, mentally. I really been dealing with a lot mentally and physically. So I'm glad you guys are still here. You guys are still supporting me. I love it. I love it. I love it. And yeah, we just gonna keep that energy up, and I'm gonna keep these con these videos rolling out. Keep content coming out for you guys. And yeah, but that's what I was saying about the whole, I didn't know what I want to do on YouTube. But I, I, and to be honest, I don't think I'm going to ever just know like, hey, this is going to be a set thing. I want to be known for doing this, doing that, doing this, doing that. Um, That's how I've always been. I just always want to be known for doing like a lot, selling a lot. Just always, I want to have my hand in every basket. I will say Bottle Girl Vlogs is something y'all can definitely count on me doing consistently. Um, I did like a little test run. That's the reason why I kind of stopped posting for like a um, a couple weeks because I want to just see like where the Bottle Girl Vlogs will go and if it's something that I really want to do. And it is. Um, so yeah. Expect more Bottle Girl Vlogs. Um, it is something that's going to be here. It's going to be sticking around for a while. So thank you guys so much for that. So now for the count. Well, I'm about to put it out first. It so this is how much a bitch made today. Y'all, so this is how much money I made today. So I'm gonna count, which I actually just counted it. And y'all wanna know some stuff funny. I'm gonna count it. I'm gonna tell y'all. This is a hundred dollar bill. He's like, I try to do these every once in a blue moon because I don't want y'all cocking my pockets. Cause y'all, I'm gonna tell y'all, 
it be some nosy people that just really want to see how much I made. And that's fine. That's why I do these videos. It's okay. It's not like I do them every night. So, regardless, y'all never going to know how much I really, really make. Because I do go to work every day. So, and some days are good days. Some days are bad days. Some days I probably make more than what y'all see. So, but this is a $100 bill. So, that's $100, $1, $2, $3, $4, $5. That's $200. One, two, three, four, five. That's three hundred. One, two. So this is twenty, forty, twenty, forty, fifty, sixty, seventy, eighty, ninety, ninety-five, hundred. That's four hundred, five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, thirty, thirty-five, forty, forty-five, fifty, fifty-five, sixty-five, sixty-five, seventy, seventy-five, eighty, eighty-five. That's four hundred and thirty-three dollars, which is so freaking funny because, as y'all know, last money count, last money count, a bitch had, <laughs> last money count, a bitch had freaking um four hundred and thirty-four dollars. So I literally made a dollar less than what I made last time I did my money count. Um, yeah, so I made four hundred and thirty-three dollars, which is really really good. Um, it's definitely funny how I made that much last time literally i made a dollar less than what i made last time well it wasn't just that busy but i did have some good tables i had some good good tables they bought some bottles so i deserve this okay i deserve this little phone. hey y'all so it's prison me here and like i said i've been trying to like delete a lot of stuff on my phone because my phone is having like storage complications so i lost the rest of this video but i just want to come and formally close it out thank you guys for watching and i will see you guys in the next one